Hello, I'm David from Clear Vision Systems. This is a demonstration of an HDMI extender which uses CAT 5E or CAT 6 to extend 1080p HDMI um, in a one-to-one, one-to-many -to -one, one or many-to-many -many configuration. This is a new addition to our range. This is the HDMI extender over Ethernet using TCP IP. It allows single transmission of HDMI signals up to 1080p in a one-to-one -one configuration or with the use of a network Ethernet switch, a one-to-many or with the use of a managed Ethernet switch, a many-to-many -many configuration. A standard kit consists of a transmitter, a receiver, two UK power supplies and infrared transmitter and receiver um, so that the source can be controlled from the display end. So I'll demonstrate first of all a single one-to-one -one configuration, a simple one-to-one -one configuration. I've got some 1080p footage playing on a media player and there he is. Okay, I've, I'm connecting the transmitter and receiver together via 50 meters of CAT6 cable. Obviously the higher the quality of the cable the more likely the system is to work at its maximum 120 meters. Okay, so that's standard one-to-one -one configuration. You can also buy additional receivers. Receivers come packaged with a infrared receiver and a UK power supply. So you can buy separate receivers to have to make up one-to-many configurations. So we can have our HDMI signal going to one transmitter and being duplicated across several receivers. To do that we need a simple Ethernet switch. Any Ethernet switch will do that job. So I'm going to connect the transmitter into one port on the switch right way up. Another port on the switch will go to the receiver. So we should see a duplication of the first video that we saw. And now if I introduce a second receiver, I can connect that to any port on the switch so now we've got two displays showing the same HDMI source the Ethernet switch is effectively an HDMI spitter in this instance. So if I want several transmitters and several receivers, I need to move to a managed switch, um, which this one is. And I've set up the first four ports to be on one VLAN and the second four ports to be on another VLAN. Um, it's extremely simple to do that and I may put together a video to show how that can be done um, in the near future. So I can take this first transmitter and connect it to the first receiver just take out that second receiver for the moment and bring in a second transmitter.
this transmitter I'm going to connect to the switch with the shielded cable 20 meters of shielded into the second set of ports and then the output well the second VLAN will go to the second receiver power up the transmitter So now the Ethernet switch is effectively acting as an HDMI matrix. Um, both transmitters are outputting 1080p images and the maximum number of transmitters and or receivers that can be set up in a network such as this is 254. And that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching.